Towson Normal Heights has been attracting a lot of attention the last couple days, but this is more than just vandalism here. 10 News anchor Lindsay Pena is live there in the neighborhood with the serious warning on these boarded up windows. Lindsay. Yeah, at first glance, you might assume that somebody just graffitied on this house and technically they did, but it's who did it that's a bit unusual. The writing on the front of this house isn't the work of vandals. It's a warning from the man living inside. And I wanted to make sure that him and any other like idiot around here knows that if you come here, you will be taken care of. Bo Engelbert, a retired Marine, wrote the message after he boarded up his house. The broken windows and hole next to the front door, the work of a mysterious attacker who tried to get inside while Engelbert's 24-year-old sister was home alone Wednesday morning. He kicked into her front window while she was changing and then tried to kick the door and then break into the other window. The suspect caught on a neighbor's surveillance camera. During the incident, the young woman managed to get to the garage and lock herself in until police showed up. But by then, the man was nowhere to be found. And apparently, a lot of my neighbors have seen that person a few times. So, Luckily, Engelbert's sister wasn't physically harmed, but it's something she won't soon forget. She's okay. She's shooken up. Uh, she's tough, though. Uh, but now I'm home, so I'm in the house. The police had said, like, if he comes in, like, just take care of business. Now, the suspect in this case is described as a white male with short, light brown or blonde hair. He was wearing a dark T-shirt and dark pants. I've also been told that police are in this area having a presence in the mornings around the time that the attack happened since then to try to catch this man. If you know anything, you're also asked to call San Diego police. Reporting live in Normal Heights, Lindsay Pena, 10 News. Hello.